Hey guys, just a quick thing, yeah? Just a quick message for you before I set off and drive about letting go. Do you know what? Letting go of stuff, situations, people can be one of the most challenging things that we experience as human beings. Sometimes we hold on to things that just are doing us no good. It's just killing us. It's just, it's like a little knife. It's just digging, 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 digging deeper and deeper and deeper. And we're holding on, holding on, even though it's hurting. You know, we hold on to people. We hold on to things, uh, garments. We hold on to, to, you know, we become hoarders of all different scenarios, things, shapes, different sizes. When you can let something go, let me tell you something, yeah? I've been going through a situation and I've been going through the situation for months and I've gone through the situation so much so they think, I'm here, turn white. <laughs> yeah? The thing is, stressing me out, stressing me out, stressing me out. And you know what? And I was praying, I was like, God, please this, God, please that, God, please the other. And then one day I just went, do you know what? I'm not doing this no more. This isn't me. This isn't what I do. I don't stress over foolishness. And I don't stress over things I can't change. Let it go. That's my message. Just let it go. Whatever it is you're holding on to that you feel that you can't live without, let it go. Because if it's supposed to be for you, it will be for you. Because what is for you cannot be unfor you. That's what I know. And so in this situation, I just decided, you know what? Hands up, I'm letting go. Do you know what's happened since then? It's been the best decision I've made. I was holding on to this thing because it was my baby. My baby, a 10-year ting, yeah? My baby. I've worked hard for it. Thought about it created a vision in my mind and made it become reality but you know what my journey here has ended the journey in that direction is not where I'm supposed to be because I'm supposed to be over here and now I'm free I'm free to do and explore and experiment in something completely new in an area that brings me so much joy, so much, so much happiness. So I just wanted to let you know, do you know what I mean? Don't let nothing hold you, bind you down because you've been doing it. Just because you've been doing it doesn't mean to say you, you have to keep doing it. Just because you should doesn't mean, just because you can doesn't mean you should. Yeah? So, and that's, oh, that's something that I'm learning. Because I, I most of you know, I'm a very talented woman. I do a lot of different things. But the road, the road is changing and it's going in curves and roundabouts and all kinds of stuff. Yeah, you ever driven in Milton Keynes? You've got a straight road then you come to a roundabout and it's like, which direction do I go? Which way, which way, which way? Let your path lead you. Let go and let God, let the universe show you where you're supposed to be. Yeah? Walk with your head high. Don't let nothing hold you down. Don't let nothing hold you back. The past is the past and it does not determine your future. If anything, it's your springboard. So get on it, jump on it and see, take a leap and see where you land. Yeah? It's up to you. It's up to you today. So it's up to you to do it today. Don't leave it for tomorrow because you, tomorrow's not promised. You don't know. Do it today. Do it today. Take a let go, take a leap, and see where you land. This is your girl, Yvonne Michelle. Ciao, ciao.